Okay, welcome back to the True Development Center. It's late on a Sunday, but inspired by my players and some of the things we had going on here. So, you know, I want to help our athletes become more than just athletes, become best, the best humans, individuals they can become. And that, a lot of that happens off the field, right? So today we're going to work about, we're going to talk about one of our core values and it's here on one of this, uh, this little image we have here that, hey, is on some of our, our, um, our clothes, right, that we, we have as well because it's really, really important to us, right? And these four words are a big part of what we do. They're part of our core values, right? The first one, trust, right? Trust is really, really big, right? And there's, there's definitions out there. The best one I found, which is assured uh, reliance on the character, ability, strength, or truth of someone or something on which confidence is placed, right? And that's a definition, right? What does a definition really mean? Like, it, it, it's a sentence, right? But you, you're not gonna learn so much. You can't just look at definitions everywhere and know everything. Oh, I know this word, so I know everything about it. And there's so much more to it, and we're gonna talk about that here. I mean, first, trust is what makes team successful, makes family successful, organizations, everything successful. It's trust between the members, right? It's what we are built to do. It's community, it's society, it's everything, right? And I think that's really important because I think there's some cool quotes here, but I think the one that I like here, and we're gonna take a look real quick, is this one, is that, he who, does, he who does not trust enough will not be trusted, right? It, it understands it's a reciprocal relationship. They both have to come together, right? And, and that's how it works. You trust me, I trust you, you trust, I trust that you're gonna get what you're gonna get done and you trust how I'm gonna get done. And if we put both pieces together, it's a better product than if we both did our individual things, right? And I'm not the guy that goes and trusts everyone because I've had experiences in my life with, with teams, with you know sporting directors, all these things, doing things that were really bad, right? And I, I lost trust in them, right? But Big part of trust is forgiving people, right? You have to be able to forgive people or types of people, right? Because if I didn't forgive certain people, I wouldn't have still played on that team. After they tried to cut my contract or whatever, I wouldn't have still played on it when I was injured. I wouldn't have still played on that team when I got healthy, right? I had to stick to my own, but at the end of the day, there were teams that tried to cut my contract when I was injured, tried to send me back home. They couldn't do this, but they tried to. And I, I lost trust in them, but I came back and I still had to play for them. I still had to play for the city. And I think that's really important, the, the forgiveness part of trust, right? If you want to be trusted, I think you have to show that you're willing to forgive people. People make mistakes, right? Like, and you have to say, hey, this is a trusting relationship. Maybe someone falls off track. Well, you bring them back up by forgiving them, right? And not saying that you have to forgive someone for the rest of your life, because that might not be a good idea, right? But trust is really important. I think, you know, we're gonna understand that any team you have, any family you have, any organization you have, this is gonna be one of the main components of a successful family, team, organization. And you know, realistically at the end of the day, in your life, because you should be an athlete watching this hopefully, and some of the parents as well, but this is for the athletes obviously, you should trust your family, right? Your parents are, have the best interest for you. Everything they do is for you and your, for, for the best interests of you. I think it's really important. Um, your coaches, right? Like we're in your life, we're doing everything we do, whether we put you through fitness or we have you do a drill that you really don't like, or you shoot with your left foot. This is because we care about you. You have to put trust in us that everything we're doing is for your best uh, interest and for your development as a human, as a person, obviously as an athlete, right? That's really important. Um, you have to trust your teachers, right? Homework projects, they don't do that just because they want to do it and they want to torture you. It's because they want you to get smarter. They want you to know yourself better. They want you to explore yourself, right? I think that's really important to trust the people around you and they have their best interests, especially when sometimes you think um, they might not have your interest. Trust your teammates, right? Trust that he's gonna get his job so I don't need to cover him and I can go do my job. The best teams I've been on, we trust each other. We had trust in each other. We create that bond that you're gonna do what you're gonna do. You're an attacker, you're gonna score. I'm a defender, I'm gonna keep goals out, right? It's simple, right? Or you're a midfielder, you go up, I go, I stay back. Or, you know, I go up, you stay back. We keep that balance, right? That trust is so important in sports and it's so important in life, right? And that's what's awesome about sports because you get to work on these in the game and then take them off the field. Because who you are here on the field doesn't mean as much as who you are off the field, right? I can tell you that from first-hand experience. I used to care only about this, who I was on the field, but later, when it's all over, these experiences, the persons, the hardships, um, the, the rewards, all that, that was the most important thing at the end of the day. And 
Lastly, and maybe most importantly, is that you trust in yourself. Trust in your ability to grow as a individual, human, family member, teammate, leader, right? You have belief in yourself. You know your potential. You know if you work smart, you work hard, you can reach it, right? And that trust is important, right? Trust will, if you have that trust in yourself, you will attract trust from others. And this is so important because to have that support system and community where everyone has trust within themselves and the others is so important. And to do that starts off with you trusting yourself. That's first and foremost. You have to, must understand yourself you must know yourself but you must trust yourself right you must trust your ability and if you have that trust then the bad days you understand hey I'm gonna work I'm gonna learn from this I'm gonna grow from these failures or these setbacks right because you trust in yourself and you believe in yourself so I think this is the most important that first and foremost you trust in yourself and how do you build trust right well we talked about there are different ways to build trust right but I think one of the biggest ones is forgiving people because there's gonna be a time where someone does something wrong and they go off course can you bring them back up to course? Can you trust them? And you don't have to do this uh, for the rest of your life. Trust and trust and trust even if they, if they keep going off course, but you have to give them a chance to be trusted. You have to trust someone, right? Like this quote says it all right here. I think that's really important. And obviously a big part of his accountability. You say something and you do it. And they know, hey, he says what he's gonna do. That's really important. It's not as easy as said as, it's not easy said as done, right? But you can do it, right? And that's how you build trust in people. Um, integrity, right? Doing the right thing when no one's looking. That's how you build trust. It's really important. And obviously, like we said, trusting other people. That's a big part of building trust. And people seeing that you're gonna trust them, that you have faith in them. It's not always the easiest thing, but it's, it's something that's important. Having faith in them to do what you guys need to be successful and, and that you don't have to do everything yourself. And, and lastly, like we said, forgiveness, right? Being willing, if someone makes a mistake, being willing to forgive them. I mean, this is how you build trust. And I think that's really, really important is that, you know, you take it upon yourself to make yourself easy to trust, right? And then you can create that relationship that's gonna build so much for you and so much for you as a person. So. I think that's really important and, and, and I think trust is really important. There's so much more to it, but we just want to talk about it and one of our core values and we want it to help you become a better human, right? And we're gonna ask a couple, couple things from you here. I want you to write on a, uh, a pro worksheet if you're a younger guy, if you're a little older, we'll give you a form. Write something, or sorry, write someone in your life that you really trust and why you trust them, right, so much. And then someone in your life that maybe you don't trust or you've lost trust and if you've forgiven them and why you've forgiven them or why you haven't forgiven them. I think that's really important. And also, you know, what you're doing in your life every day to build trust, right? I, we want you to write these down and send them to us and, and or turn them in if it's you're a true player and you're turning or you're doing the pro work. You write it on, right under the difference you made. You can just try to fill it in there and, and uh, I know they're small sheets, but work it in there, maybe write small, but we appreciate you and we wanna help you become a better human, a better person, and this is part of it. So thank you so much. Thank you for trusting us and taking this time to watch it. Whether you're a parent, you're a player, whoever it is, we appreciate you, we trust you, and we're so thankful to have you as part of our community. Have a great night.